partner of a man who died while trying to help others. She reached out to 11 News today to share his story. Joel Montalvo, whose picture is right here on the screen behind us, was crossing I-25 to try to help other people involved in a wrong way head-on collision early Sunday morning and never made it to the other side. He was hit by another driver. 11 News anchor Grace Kramer is joining us live from where this tragedy unfolded near the MLK bypass. You spoke with Joel Montalvo's partner today. Adam Lindsay, this is a heartbreaking story. Tracy Bennett tells me she had been with Joel for more than six years. She tells me that Joel was full of life and joy and was always willing to help anyone in need, no matter the cost. I told him I loved him and I told him that I'd see him soon. And then an hour and 15 minutes later, he was gone. Joel Montalvo filled his life with family, love, and his passion for helping others, even serving in the U.S. Navy for more than 20 years. His life was cut short at the age of 64. I'm still waiting for him to come home. Tracy Bennett, Joel's partner, says he was driving home to Fort Collins from Arizona on Sunday. And that was his Mother's Day vacation that he went down to go see her for seven days and everything. And He's made that drive a thousand times. But sadly, that drive would be his last. Tracy says Joel pulled over to help with a deadly crash in the middle of the interstate, something he had done before. We would pull over and we'd try to help. I'm a nurse and my code that I live by is that if somebody needs my help, I'm going to help them. And he was the same way. That was one of the many things that we had in common. Another driver hit Joel, and he was pronounced dead on scene. Tracy tells me she will never forget the selflessness Joel showed her and others throughout his entire life, a selflessness he demonstrated until the very end. I was so proud to know that he was willing to risk himself for another human. The family has a GoFundMe set up tonight that we will have linked in this story on our website. That is KKTV.com. Reporting live in Colorado Springs, Grace Kramer, KKTV 11 News. Just a horrible.